What is up, players? It's Warboss Tay up in this mug. Welcome to my first bootcamp video for the 2017 July Painting Challenge. And uh, this is the box of the new starter kit for Warhammer 40k 8th edition called Dark Imperium. And um, I'm, I'm maybe I'll do an unboxing. I don't know. There are so many unboxings out there already, and I kind of want to just get stuck into what I'm going to be doing. But for my first, or I guess for the first question for the bootcamp is uh, what are you going to be working on and this is what I'm going to create. It's the starter kit for the uh, Dark Imperium. I'm going to aim to do all of the Ultramarines and all of the Nurgle faction and uh, yeah that's going to be my goal for the July Painting Challenge. It's really exciting because these are all new models and I think a lot of people are going to be working on either one or the other or both of these factions for uh, for the <laughs> for the foreseeable future just because it's so new and uh, the new edition of the game is out and it's a very exciting time to be in the hobby. So that's that's my day one question. I hope you also take part in the boot camp if you're interested and uh, if you're going to be taking part in the July painting challenge. That's 31 days of filming and posting and uh, I'm really looking forward to it. I'm still finishing up the questions for the actual July painting challenge but all of the boot camp questions are going to be up in the Google group and uh, you can take a look at them there. So, hey, thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you're all having a great day. I'll, uh, I guess since this is boot camp, I can talk about what else I've got going out, uh, going on at my at my workstation here. I'm finishing up this Carcharodon's Leviathan Siege Dread, and I, I guess I could talk about it more in, in a separate video. But you might have seen me, um, I guess, showing him off, magnetized. I've been working on him all night and all day. The last thing I have to do is the tattoo work. And I've got so many Carcharodon's esque themed uh, tattoos and I guess uh, iconography and pictures in my, uh, in my folder on my phone. And uh, I just wanted to kind of chart it out and see what I want to do. I'm thinking maybe some, uh, some scroll work, definitely on the front plates here. I'm not sure where to put the... Maybe I'll, I'll, I'll do a skull, uh, that stylized Polynesian tattoo kind of skull over here. And um, maybe the shark symbol here on the left. And then I'm just thinking some crazy uh, patterns throughout the rest of the armor. And I kind of did the front grill. I think I've seen, I, I've seen a couple other people do this online. They kind of did, did it like, uh, I imagine a shark's mouth opening up as, as he's coming in to, to bite. I think now that I'm looking at it, the top row might be a little bit teeth might be a little too long I might do more of an angle like the shark's mouth is actually opening up more yeah I think that's what I'm gonna do but hey it's never a better time to get more creative than it is now there's the magnetized top part for the missiles and I'm working on all of the weapons options too I'm giving them all the kind of dust and dirt and uh, grime that I've got on the rest of the model just to show that it's been uh, used. He's actually tromping around the field and uh, getting getting work done. So thanks for watching everybody and uh, I hope you're all doing great out there and if you're interested in taking part in the July painting challenge and thinking about hopping into the boot camp, now's a great time to do it. We'll see you in the next video.